The landscape in Parkersburg is changing drastically, daily. Today, the entire student body from BCLUW High School spent their final day of classes on an unforgettable field trip, learning how effective many hands can be when a giant task is at hand. I feel like we've, we're putting a dent in. I'm glad we're here. While volunteers have helped pile up hundreds of thousands of tons of debris along curbs, the really heavy lifting along the highway through town is being handled by a Tennessee company called Disaster Recovery Solutions. They specialize in hurricane cleanup, but in the off season travel across the country to help tornado cleanups. And they don't charge for tornadoes. It's important for the community to see progress. It's important for the community to see that debris is being picked up. The company has two state-of-the-art high-speed hydraulic cranes in Parkersburg that can fill a dump truck in under three minutes. They're specifically uh, designed to handle uh, any type of disaster type debris, whether it's cars, walls, roofs. Yesterday, from sunup to sundown, they filled 375 truckloads of debris, starting an amazing assembly line that ends less than a mile away, where a constant stream of trucks are slowly transporting the south side of Parkersburg to a makeshift landfill. The owner of Disaster Recovery says from his extensive experience, he expects all the debris could be picked up in Parkersburg in a month. Progress is happening and it's happening quickly and the city's going to be cleaned up and the city's going to be rebuilt. The mayor says most of the homeowners in Parkersburg are staying and the ones that are leaving he's been told are for the most part selling their properties to their neighbors and then there are businesses, 21 that were destroyed like this bank. Several of them have already indicated they will rebuild. This bank is already functional again. Take a look behind me, that little trailer, that's where they're going to be operating for the rest of the week. You can make your withdrawals and deposits inside. In Parkersburg, Mark Tauschek, Channel 13 News.